everyone. Thank you for tuning in for Embracing My Melanin. It's your girl, Rochelle. And in today's video, as you saw by the title, I am going to be doing a swatch review on the Fenty Beauty Glossy Posse, okay? I believe that's what it's called. Yeah, the Glossy Posse. <laughs> if you want to see how these new shades work on my skin tone, the more deep melanated skin tone, please keep on watching. <laughs> when Fenty Beauty announced for their 2019, one of the items to come out for their 2019 holiday collection will be um, more shades in the Fenty Gloss Balm, okay? So when that was announced on Trend Mood, when I saw it, I was like, okay, I'm going to get it. There, there was no questions asked. That was not even a thought to even think about. I knew that I was going to pick this up, okay? Because I have been waiting for them to come out with more shades in the Gloss Balm. I have the Fenty Glow and I have Fussy, what I'm wearing right now. And they have come out with a few more shades for the holidays, okay? And here they are right there, okay? We have four new shades along with Fussy and a miniature, okay? So there's Fussy right there, but all the rest of them are new shades, okay? So I'm wearing Fussy right now. I have it in the full size, okay? So chances are, I don't know, my little sister, she loves, um, she likes glosses and everything too, so I might might, I'm not 100% sure, I might be giving this to my baby sister, okay? She's 13, you know, she just turned 13 a couple months ago, so mm, this is not something that's overly, overly pigmented that her mom would object of. So I know my mama Sonya, I know she would not mind my little sister wearing this right here, which is what I'm wearing right now. Such a beautiful shade, I'm not gonna swatch this one, I'm gonna show you with this one. Such a beautiful light pink shade okay a baby pink blush pink shade okay so pretty so pretty and with enough pigmentation for you know it to give your lips a little something extra without being pow okay so that's what i love about fussy i saw it and i was like okay it's giving me a little pink action on the lips so that's what I'm wearing right now. <laughs> okay. Now, the other four shades, they're saying they're limited edition. Fingers, toes, and eyes crossed that they're not going to be limited edition. Hopefully, they're going to bring these out in the full size shades and they're going to curate even more shades for the uh, gloss bombs because I love the formula. But let's see if the formula stay the same with these, okay? Okay, so first up, I'm gonna go in with the shade Confetti, okay? When this first came out, I thought it was like the, um, I think it was called the Diamond Balm that came out for their one year anniversary with Fenty. I thought that was the same shade, but I think this is very much so a different shade. Yeah, okay. So this one, the other one came off more maybe purple and undertone whereas this one is coming off more blue and pink and undertone okay so that's the difference between the two this one is most definitely a little bit more blue and purple i'm not sure if you guys can see that but that's what i'm seeing from here whereas the other one was more um was more purple. This is blue and pink, okay? So let's see how it look, okay? Okay, so there it is right there. Y'all, so pretty. From what I could tell, from what I'm feeling, the formulation is the same. The formula is the same. I didn't smell it. How could I think it smell it? I believe it smells the same. I'm everything is in my nose right now. And my nose doesn't not necessarily work the best, but here it is right here. It is giving me more blue pink. Yeah, it has more blue sparkles in it some blue and some pink. It's really, really pretty. Okay. 
gives off just a slight bit of blue and that's not a bad thing it's not a bad thing at all so i like it i think the other one gave off purple and pink but this gives off blue and pink okay very very pretty it doesn't like clash with the skin the first thing you think when you're deeper darker skin tone is that is this white is going to be horrible but it's not that bad you put a brown lip liner on with it any color lip liner on with it put this on top of it boom good i like this one this is pretty this is confetti mm -hmm. okay, so next up we're going to try pretty please okay pretty peas is more of a hot pink when you look at it in the um in the bottle but let's see how she does on the lips okay Okay, now here is Pretty Please, okay? I like Pretty Please, okay? Pretty Please gives you more of a pink than fussy, okay? So if you like just a little bit more pigmentation, just a little bit more pink to pop off on the lips, Pretty Please. Woo! Whereas Fussy, Fussy is more of just a soft, delicate uh, blush pink, okay? So there are the difference right there. That's more like a blush nudie pink where there's that hot pink that gives you more pigmentation on the lips. That's pretty. I like that, okay? I know good and well that when my little sister sees it, she's gonna like, can I have that one? She's gonna want this one. Oh, it still smells good. And the formula is still comfortable on the lips. It's not sticky at all. Y'all, yes. Ooh, that is just so pretty. It's so pretty. Yeah, I like that, okay? Okay, so next up, we are going to go in with the shade Cheeky, okay? Cheeky is more of a fiery red-orange color is really really pretty really really pretty let me swatch it on the back of my hand real quick yeah more of a fiery red red orange color okay yeah let's see So here is Cheeky, okay? I like it. Oh, I like it. It's so freaking pretty. Rihanna, you know what? I can't, my nose is horrible, y'all. Okay, yeah, it has that scent, okay? Okay, but here is Cheeky, okay? It does have the smell that it has, okay? The, the signature candy, your childhood smell that you just love. Okay, and there it is on the back of my hand. I, listen, this, oh, this is so pretty. This is so freaking pretty. I love it. Gives you just kissable, pouty, glowy lips that you, that you just love, that you just love to have, okay? But here is Cheeky. <laughs> Last but not least, the one that we have really been waiting for okay it is hot chocolate oh my goodness when i tell you when i saw this one i saw it was a chocolate color i was like rihanna yeah There it is right there. You really can't see it because it blends in so well with my skin tone, <laughs> which I love, okay? So let's see how hot chocolate does. And here we are 
with hot chocolate, okay? I like it, okay? It, I think because it's such a deep, it's a deeper shade, it's going to come out just a little bit deeper than the first one, than, um, what was it, confetti, okay? Because it is a chocolate lip gloss, okay? Let me, you know what, let me do it on the front of my palm right here so y'all can possibly see that, okay? Let me see if I can get the light to adjust to it, okay? There it is. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's, uh, <laughs> you know, but it's a really pretty, pretty, pretty shade. It's chocolate. It's beautiful. It goes a lot better than a lot of lip glosses that I buy when I want a very pretty clear shade with just a hint of brown in it. And this is something unique because you don't see this color at all. I mean, I don't, I've never seen this color in my history of trying to find pretty brown lip glosses. I think maybe Avon, and this just tells you in what era I grew up in. I think I found one in Avon years ago, but they discontinued it and I have not seen it since. And it's been a good long time. I mean, it's been over 15 years since I last saw that lip gloss. I can't even remember the name of it. Okay, so, ooh, Fenty. Rihanna, baby. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so that was my quick swatch review on the Fenty Glossy Posse lip glosses, or excuse me, their gloss bombs, okay? I loved every shade. Of course, I already have Fussy, okay? But all the other ones, Cheeky, Confetti, and Pretty Please, and oh my goodness, Hot Chocolate? Y'all, like, Rihanna, stop teasing us and just go ahead and make these full size. Especially, especially this one right here. Oh, chat. Chat. Stop teasing us. Just go ahead and make that one full size so I can go and get another one. Let's go ahead and let's just go ahead and do it, okay? Do it for me. You don't know me, but go ahead and do it for me, okay? <laughs> but other than that, I absolutely love these. One quick little bit of information. This is something I noticed when I was putting it on. All of these shades, less about, um, not so much fussy, but I didn't check uh, this fussy inside here. But all of these shades have just a little bit of a glitter, um, inside of it okay i noticed it a lot with um pretty please and confetti okay and there was just a little bit in it with um with hot chocolate not that much with hot chocolate and just a little bit in with a uh, cheeky okay i will say that so if you don't like glitter that much and it wasn't chunky okay you can see it especially when you were um when I was wiping it off and going to the next shade, there was just a little bit inside of it, but more so with Pretty Please and Confetti, okay? Not so much with these two, but it was still there. So I just want to give you that heads up, okay? I'm just going to let you know, because when I noticed that, I was like, oh, a little bit of glitter, but it wasn't terrible. I was, It was easy to get off of me, okay? All right, but that is it. That is all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and just click the subscription button below. Subscription button. The subscribe button below, okay? And I hope you enjoyed me and my brand of crazy. My name is Rochelle, and I thank you so much for watching. Stay blessed and stay beautiful. Bye. <laughs>